what's going on infinite fam welcome back to another video if you guys are new to the channel make sure you guys hit that subscribe button turn on your post notification bell leave a positive comment down below for a chance to get a post notification shout out at the end of today's video so as you guys can tell we are not home right now and i am currently by myself janice is out there in the kitchen talking to her stepdad we made a little trip to florida if you guys follow us on instagram you guys would have known that a couple of days ago so if you guys don't follow us on instagram make sure you guys follow us right now but yeah like i said janice is out there in the kitchen talking to her stepdad and you guys already know the first video i'm gonna give to you guys while we're in florida is gonna be a prank you guys already know i'm always coming with the bangers i'm always coming with that heat so as you guys can tell by the title and thumbnail of the video your boy is basically going to be telling his girl that her parents are really annoying and i don't want to be here anymore now obvious guys just a disclaimer that is completely false i love janice's parents they take great care of us they're always making sure we're comfortable we're fed so on and so forth i love her parents as if like they were my own so everything i'm going to be saying is going to be completely false guys but you guys know i gotta get a little crazy just to get janice crazy so janice thinks that we're going to be taking her mom's car we're going to go vlog grab some stuff to eat but that's not the case when we get in the car and i set up the camera i'm basically going to be acting like i'm in a little bit of a mood like i'm annoyed or i'm not really like in that happy mood that you guys usually see me in now obviously me being like that she's gonna ask me what's wrong and then that's when i'm just gonna let her have it now if you guys are an og to the channel you, you guys will know that janice did this prank on me about a year and a half ago give or take where she told me that she hated my family so i'm gonna consider this a revenge prank so if you guys are ready for today's video make sure you guys smash that thumbs up button comment down below team isaiah all day every day let's get into it three two one what's going on infinite fam welcome back to another video if you guys are new to the channel make sure you guys hit that subscribe button turn on your post notification bell leave a positive comment down below for a chance to get a what for a chance to get a shout out in the next video that is right guys so today we are going to be basically what are we what are we doing why do you have such like down energy what do you mean you sound like bad like you're not excited i'm just telling them what we're doing yeah but you don't sound excited all right come on again three two one so as you guys can tell by the title and thumbnail of the video today we are going to be vlogging we're going to be going to this mexican food spot right what is it called yes it is called i forgot what it's called do you remember i forgot too i, I don't know uh, it's really really good though isaiah yesterday had a burrito from there and he has been obsessed ever since right babe it was all right um hold on guys i'm gonna relocate outside real quick because i feel like it's a little dark in here so i'm just gonna do that and then we'll pick up the camera back when i get outside all right i think this lighting is better okay. i'm just gonna park right here for the meantime until we finish the clip and okay. then i'll drive off to the spot and then we can tell them what's going on can you seriously tell me what's wrong with you because you're like nothing acting... is wrong with me why do you think something's wrong with me babe i can tell when something's wrong with you you're acting mad weird if i tell you i feel like you're gonna like catch feelings and i honestly i just don't want to ruin the trip that we're on like i just don't want I don't, want, I don't want to mess anything up. No, because I know you're going to catch feelings. You're How gonna am get, I going to catch feelings? You're going to get offended by it, and because I would get offended by it. So it's like, I'd rather just keep my mouth shut. No, now you have to tell me. If I tell you, don't, like, give me crap or, like, like I'm, well, I'm, be, I'm being honest with it? you. I'm being, I'm going to be honest with you. I don't get why you're mad, though. There's I'm, like... not, I'm not mad or anything. I'm, I'm annoyed. I'm going to tell you. I'm a little annoyed. Okay. But I'm not mad or anything like that. But if I tell you... You can't like catch feelings or anything like that because I'm being honest with you. You're asking me to tell you what's wrong. I'm going to tell you what's wrong. Okay. All right. This is like mad random out of nowhere. It's like, not random out of nowhere. It's been yes, since sir. I woke up. No, it's been since I woke up. Okay. What is it then? Your parents, I feel like for, I don't know, I guess to say like nicely, they're annoying. <gasps> annoying they're annoying they they're really annoying they're like always on top of us they don't especially like your dad like he does not leave me alone bro like he's always asking like yo do you want to go outside you want to shoot some ball or like yo you want to go work out in the garage like bro what makes you think i want to like spend time with you Ooh, you know what i mean that's like, hella messed up i'm t see i knew you were gonna do this no and, but the, it's not even me catching feelings first of all that's mad disrespectful don't talk about it, my family do not talk you're about my asking family me, like that. you're asking me to tell you what's wrong and then your mom is asking me oh do you want to eat this do you want to eat that like bro I, no like you're overfeeding me like relax relax they could have honestly not even welcomed you in their home first of all next time i don't want to stay here i don't want to stay here with them like i'd rather us get a hotel like me personally i rather get a hotel you can stay here with them but i i don't want to stay here next time we come i really don't and how dare you bro how what do you mean how dare me you how dare me you how dare you how dare you say something like that are you kidding 
you told me to tell you what's wrong, and I told you don't catch feelings because I'm gonna be honest with you. And you now have no valid reason to be annoyed by that, though. They're they're I doing all this stuff because they care. I just gave you reasons. No, why there's a... there's no reason. That's so stupid and invalid. First of all, you wanted so a my feelings are invalid. No, because you wanted a relationship with my dad so bad. You have a great relationship with ha with him now. That's the whole reason why he asks you to go out and do stuff with him. Okay, because but now you guys it's too much. Bond. Now he's just How annoying. Is it too much? Now How he's is just it annoying? annoying. It's annoying. How? I just told you i just told you you act like they be beasting us like they don't even bother us they try their best not to bother us bro i told you that he's like on top of me and your mom Nobody's is always trying to overfeed you. me your mom is always like are you okay are you comfortable like yes bro like just leave me alone i'm you? good are I'm you good. dumb it's not even i just told you it's not even about like the overfeeding she's always like oh are you comfortable you're good like bro i'm good like just leave me alone like that's mad rude like for real she wants to make sure that you're happy and you you're asked me to tell you what's wrong that's I told called you being wrong. a hostess like are you dumb it's called being annoying. Ooh, how about your damn like, annoying? It's like it's like a gnat at a barbecue. Like it's just like you're not, zzz, you're not like, about to continue to talk about my family like that. You asked me to tell you it was wrong. I told you it was wrong. No, because I knew you were gonna catch offense. I knew you were gonna get offended. I knew. Um, it. who wouldn't get offended? This is why I didn't want to say anything, and I wanted to keep my mouth shut. Now the rest of the trip, I feel like it's gonna be awkward because you're gonna have this negative energy for the next two days. No, right your ass could go home because you're the one with the negative energy. Everybody's in a good ass mood, making sure you're good. Because this is not your family and they're trying to make you family and you're over here saying that they're annoying when they try to be inclusive with you. Honestly, you have some of their traits because you being annoying right now. I don't Ooh. give a shit. I really don't. You could get annoyed with me as much as possible. Then we don't have to be together then if you don't like my family and if you don't respect my family. I'm going to defend my family a thousand percent before I defend you because your feelings are valid, of course. But don't be sitting here talking crap about my family. About I'm not going to let that slide. How about instead of coming crazy at me, you be like, you know what, babe? I'm going to go in there. I'm going to tell my dad, you know, stop being annoying. Isaiah feels bothered. And mom, stop feeding Isaiah so much because he's gaining weight. How about you go ahead and tell them that? Help me out. Weight. Help me out. Like, you sound dumb, man. You I really sound, do. All right. So now I'm dumb. My feelings are invalid. It's like I just don't matter. All right. Cool. It's not that you don't matter. Nah, it's not, it's, it's that cool. It's cool. There's it's there's cool. expressing your feelings and then there's blatant disrespect. You're literally. I'm not being disrespectful. Yes, you are. You You're literally me, talking you told... crap about my family. How is that not disrespectful? You're saying that they're annoying when they're trying to. Bro, help you, you told me to tell you what's wrong. I'm telling you, I'm annoyed. What's annoying me? Your family being annoying is annoying me. I'm. My being, family's I'm... not being annoying. To you, they're not. To me, they are. This is why I told you next time we come, I don't want to stay here. Your dad's being really annoying. Your mom is being really annoying like geez like i feel like the only one who's being chill right now is like your sister and it's because she has her ipad so she's like you know she's being kept busy i'm about to get your stepdad and and your mom a, an ipad so they can keep busy and just leave me the hell alone i can't believe you right now seriously like right, this personality so. is disgusting um, you asked me to tell you it was wrong. I'm telling you it was wrong. Yeah, well, I, I told you. I knew you was gonna get offended. I knew you was gonna get offended. Next time, I'll just keep my mouth shut, and then that's it. I really don't want anything to do with you at this point. What do you mean? Like your personality is disgusting. You're disgusting me right now. This is a whole other side of you that I just. So don't what do you mean me. you don't want anything to do with me right now? Like you don't want to be with me, or what? What does that mean? I just don't want to talk to you. I don't want to be around you. Like you can go home. Honestly, you can catch a flight. I'll book your flight, and you can go home. Cause this is disgusting like I really this is not you and I don't know where it's coming from but you need to either shape up or go home because I'm not dealing with this was that a fat joke no it's not a fat joke and I'm not trying to be funny like I really don't like how you her, how you're acting right now well <sighs> can I say something no I want to tell you something. I really don't want to do hear it. I really don't want to hear it. It's the last thing I have to say about your parents. It's the last what? thing I have to say about your parents. What else? Guys, say something thing. else disrespectful because I'm really about to pop off now. Can I say it without you, like... Can I say it? Without me what? Can I say it? Because I'm not even yelling. Can you want to hear me it? yelling? Bro, it's I will. it's literally the last thing I have to say about your parents. What? It's the last thing what? I have to say. What? And you can't get offended. You, you can't say I can't get offended. Like, I'm going to get offended with stuff. Can I say it? Go. Go ahead. Your parents are, like, the best freaking in-laws to ever have, yo. I freaking love your parents, yo. Get, let me see. Let me see. Good job for you for having parents like that. I know it wasn't your choice, but come on. Give me give me some knuckles, yo. I freaking love your in-laws. This is a prank. This is a prank. Say team Isaiah. I already did an intro in the room when you was talking to your stepdad about freaking, I don't know what it was. You guys were talking about what in the kitchen? I overheard something. Necklaces.
yeah, something like that, jewelry or something like that. I don't know what it was. She was showing her, she was showing her stepdad a chain or something like that of a spider. No, don't right. be saying this stuff. All right, well, that we're I not want. gonna talk about it. But I knew you, you was talking about something like that. Anywho, um, yeah, I did an intro in the bedroom and I told them that I was gonna be talking a little crazy to get you crazy. Obviously, it worked. But I already told them that disclaimer, yo, your parents are like the best in-laws to have. They're always making sure I'm kept good, I'm fed, I'm comfortable. So yeah, yo, you have like the best parents ever. I couldn't ask for better in-laws. Like I wouldn't be moving to Florida. You guys already know that we've been trying to move to Florida and all that. I wouldn't be trying to move over here if. I didn't like your parents. Like, why would I want to be closer to people I don't like? I it don't doesn't know. make sense. I'm just saying, like, that, it just took me as a shock. Like, I see your dad I as, like, why you would say that. your dad is, like, my second dad. You know what I mean? Like, we always hear balling up. It's, I'm telling you, the relationship me and her stepdad have is, like, the best thing ever. I, I've never seen a better relationship when it comes to, like, in-laws. It's very true. I don't know. That's why I felt some type of way, especially because, of, like, my dad talks to Isaiah like more than me sometimes and I be getting annoyed. He be calling me on FaceTime like yo what's going on like that is, and then like stuff with cars like with his car like his personal stuff and I'll be like yo I'm like yo she he really called me and not her. That's what's up. No, that's not what's up but whatever. Jelly, jelly. So what? Yeah, like, look at you. Look that's at you. my dad, not yours. Yeah, whatever, bro. So yeah guys, that is it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Honestly, did you expect anything else though? Did you expect me to get an L? I don't think so. Whatever. I don't bro. take L's over here. That's on Team Janice only. So if you're on Team Janice, think about switching to Team Isaiah because over here we catch nothing but dubs and I'm always dropping heat and bangers for you guys. You guys already know how it is. But with all that being said, guys, it is now time for today's post notification shout out. I want today's post notification shout out to go out to your parents. Aww. For always making sure we're good, we're always fed, we're comfortable, obviously letting us stay in their house and just overall me having a good relationship with them because you know some in-laws be crazy and they just like hate the person that their kid is with and it just it's it gets bad but yo shout out to your parents for like just being the way that they are and with all that being said you got anything else you want to say no that's all all right so with all that being said we'll see you guys in the next video